نحمده ونصلي ونسلم على رسوله الكريم ما بعد فاعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم يا ايها الذين امنوا اتقوا الله وكونوا مع الصادقين صدق الله العلي العظيم وبلغنا رسوله النبي الامين الكريم ونحن على ذلك من الشاهدين والشاكرين والحمد لله رب العالمين today we have gathered here online to commemorate the urs of my sheikh my murshid huzur mufti azam hind radiyallahu ta'ala anhu i have been told to speak in the english language today so i will try to speak a few words inshallah many books and booklets have been written on his life and many speeches have been spoken in his praise but the truth is we cannot do justice to his life in writing or by his speech allah tbarak wa taala choose him for preserving the true ahle sunnah wal jamaah the maslak of ala hazrat and allah tbarak wa taala blessed him with so many barakat that he was the marja alam for all the needs of the muslimin even the non muslims came to him for help and accepted islam on his hand his istiqamat and his karamat have no example in his time he was a born wali of allah and that is why he was adorned with taqwa and zuhd from childhood until he left this world huzur qutb e madina sheikh ziauddin ahmad madani radhiyallahu anhu said مفتی اعظم قبلہ کی پیدائش کے وقت میں سولہ سال کا تھا میں نے مفتی اعظم کا بچپن دیکھا جوانی دیکھی اور اب بڑھاپا بھی دیکھا لوگ بڑھاپے میں عمل کی طرف توجہ کرتے ہیں بڑھاپے میں عمل کی طرف توجہ کرنا کوئی کمال کی بات نہیں ہے جوانی و منیحات شریعہ سے محفوظ رہنا اور شریعت مستفیہ پر عمل کرنا کمال ہے ضیاء الدین احمد نے اپنی آنکھوں سے دیکھا و اللہ العظیم مفتی اعظم بچپن ہی سے پے کرے علم و عمل ہیں جامع زہد و تقوا ہیں اس وقت ان کے علم و فضل زہد و تقوا بزرگی و پرہیزگاری فخر و عرفان کا کوئی کیا اندازہ لگا سکتا ہے فقیر عمر میں تو مفتی اعظم ہند سے بڑا ضرور ہے لیکن مراتب میں مفتی اعظم ہند فقیر سے بہت بڑے ہیں ہو از سینگ دس دس از دا قطب آف مدینہ ہی از اے گریٹ اسکالر اینڈ گریٹ ولی آف اللہ تبارک و تعالیٰ ہی سیڈ آئی واز سکسٹین ایٹ دا ٹائم آف مفتی اعظم قبلہ قبلہ از برتھ I saw his childhood and his youth and now I have observed him old age. People pay attention to Amal at all age. There is no excellence in paying attention towards Amal at old age. Excellence is to remain protected from what the Sharia has prohibited and to do Amal on the Sharia of our Master Mustafa Wasallam at young age. He then says, Fakir has seen with his own eyes, Wallahi Lazeem, Mufti Azam has been from a young age an embodiment of ilm, an amal, a possessor of zohd and taqwa in this time, who can give a measurement for his ilm and amal and his zohd and taqwa and his 
buzurgi and parhezgari how can we say who mufti azam hind was when here huzur mufti e qutb madina is implying that nobody can understand the level of mufti azam's knowledge and his piety huzur qutb madina then says faqir is definitely definitely in age bigger than mufti azam hind but in maratib ranks mufti azam is a lot more bigger than this faqir this is how we understand the words of huzur qutb madina that he is saying that i may be the qutb of madina but mufti azam hind is the qutb alam huzur mufti azam hind radhiyallahu ta'ala anhu was the greatest mufti of his time and his fatwa were accepted in ghair munqasim undivided india and all over the world including the arab world the ulama of haramain sharifain used to send their istifta to bareilly sharif in the darufta of huzur mufti azam hind he shows us what sharia is and he taught us what taqwa is he always choose to do amal on taqwa and not ruksa muttaqi ban kar dikhaye is zamane mein koi ek mere mufti e azam ka taqwa chhod kar in every moment of of his life he was thinking about the sunna of sayyidina rasul sallallahu alaihi wasallam he would not only act upon the farais and wajibat but he would also act upon all the sunan and mustahabat without fail this was his devotion and love for rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam that is why he himself said ek par khuda hai to ek par muhammad agal qalb agar qalb apna dopara karu main may allah tbarak wa taala bless us with the faiz of huzur mufti azam hind and may we rise on the day of qiyama in the circle of mufti azam hind may allah keep us on maslak e ala hazrat farm us on maslak e ala hazrat till our last breath wa akhiru dawana alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin